It is Greece's second largest city, with a population of more than a million people. The city's coastline is a major tourist attraction, but it's also an hour's drive to the border with Macedonia, which is the main crossing point for refugees to the rest of Europe. Over a million refugees have passed through Greece in 2015. Many of them went through this city, and that has brought much needed cash to the local economy. Some of the refugees came here with money to spend and get by. As far as the economy of the city is concerned, all restaurants, cafes and boutiques, all shops had a positive boost. Cheap hotel rooms have been in demand. The Hotel Association in Thessaloniki says more than 25,500 Syrian refugees have booked a room for a night or two in the first half of 2015. That number is expected to rise because there are other refugees from different nationalities staying at cheap hotels. The cheapest room you can find in the street costs about 20 euros. The city's mayor says Greece is not after the refugees' money. Uh, people, mainly Syrians, uh, which had some economic um, uh, you know, ability, they stayed in the hotel, in certain hotels in Saloniki for one, two, three, four days. But uh, uh, this was just...